How you doing? My name is Trenton Henderson. You're tuning into the famous Living Rim Network. Divine powers are always working for us because we're doing right. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, yeah, my name is Trenton Henderson. I'm a YouTube vlogger here on YouTube. I have over 1,260 videos. I've been doing this for four years. And a lot of people say, Trinis, you have manifested your dream life. <laughs> you have over 60,000 something subscribers. And man, you really doing things, man. And, and it's funny because I look at them like, really? I have? Like, I, I have? Am I really doing things? See, I'm going to tell you something about manifesting your dream life and success. Manifesting your dream life with no struggle. And this is what nobody tells you. You would have never knew that you manifested your dream life until somebody told you, okay? Because if you was all by yourself and you was doing the best you can to get to where you gotta go, how was it that you would ever know that you have manifested your dream life until somebody told you? Okay, the reason why people tell you that you have succeeded on certain levels in your life is because you've reached certain levels of consciousness that they have not yet reached. You are on a different level of vibration. You're no different from the next person. I'm no different from the next person. It's just that I choose to go to a higher consciousness than the next person. And the person that's still right here on consciousness number one, they see me as a big time YouTuber. But really, I'm, a, I'm just another guy like you are. I got problems, I got struggles, I got bills, <laughs> okay? So, with that being said, I also want to tell you this before I get into the topic of how to manifest your dream life with no struggle. Revelation. Right now, you are living your dream life. Why? Because you only get one life to live, right? You only get one life to live. Okay, if you don't believe me. So you mean to tell me in this one life to live, you're going to fail. You mean to tell me you're not going to live your dream life. You're watching this video right now. You're getting a confirmation right now that you are already living your dream life. But see, the thing is, you just have to realize that you're already living it. See, I'm just a part of your process. I'm just a part of your journey. The universe has sent me into your reality to be able to tell you, hey, you're, you're already living it. I just need you to put the pieces together so that you can see the vision that you've already accomplished already up to this point. Everything that you've experienced up to this point, <laughs> it's already done, okay? You've already created what you needed to create already up to this point to manifest your dream life, okay? So in this video, what I'm about to do is I'm about to tell you how to manifest your dream life with no struggle, okay? Now, when it comes to manifesting your dream life, the only person that you are against is your lower self, okay? You're also against other people. And you're also against your very own situation, okay? So once again, I'm going to say that. When it comes to manifesting your dream life, the three things that you're facing against right now is your lower self, other people, and your current situation. Now, your lower self is the part of you that don't think that you can accomplish this. That's the negative part of you when you're down and out, you don't have no money and all the negative thoughts penetrate you and make you upset and angry. Your lower self thinks like that. But your higher self is what encourages you to watch this video right now. Your higher self is the part of you that tells you, it's already done. Like I just told you, like you're already living it right now. You just gotta open your eyes to be able to see it. That's your higher self. But your lower self and your higher self always battle. Now when it comes to other people, you're against other people as well because other people can't see where you want to go and they can't see what you want to be. Other people can't see your dream until you bring that dream into reality. Okay, so you're also against pessimistic people, opinionated people, people that are biased, people that are judgmental and stereotypical. You're also against other people. And then the worst ever, which is the one I always had a problem getting by, you're also against your very own circumstance and situation. Yes, because when you can see the problem right before your eyes and your situation, it's like, yo, how can I not believe this? I'm going through this right now. Can't nobody else convince me that this is not real. I am literally experiencing this traumatic situation right now. It is real as my eyes can see it. But see, <laughs> here's the catch. 
when you believe in the law of attraction, when you want to manifest things, we're believing in invisible forces. The word manifestation don't have nothing to do with something that can be seen. The word manifestation has everything to do with things that are unseen that you bring into your reality. Okay, so you you have to get in the habit of continuously understanding that what you're believing in is something that is not yet seen that you are creating and bringing into your reality. Okay, now the next thing that you must understand when manifesting your dream life with no struggle is you have to get yourself into the habit of speaking things into existence. And not only speaking things into existence, but you have to also believe what you speak into existence. Because like I said, once again, who are you up against? Other people. Exactly. So here, here's the truth of the reality. I'm about to tell you some really groundbreaking stuff that nobody's ever told you before. Okay. Nobody can see what you see in your reality. I'm going to say that once again. Nobody can see what you see in your reality. That's why when people say, you know, I've seen ghosts, I've seen paranormal activity. That's why other people cannot get into their reality to be able to see it because this is something that's going on in their mind that their mind is creating and manifesting for only them to see because they're the only ones that are manifesting it. See what I'm saying? Everybody lives in the reality of his and her own. But it's up to you to bring what you are witnessing and experiencing and seeing in your reality into everyday present reality so everybody can see. See, this dream that you have, it's not that it doesn't exist. Oh, it's really real. I mean, it's as real as me talking to you right now, telling you how real it is and how far you've come. But what you have to do is you have to bring this dream that you see in your vision, in your mind's eye, you know it's already yours. You can feel it. You have to bring it into existence so that other people can see. And you have to defeat your lower self. You have to defeat the opinions of other people's. And you have to defeat what you see in your situation. And you have to believe in what you are speaking. Okay? That's the thing about it. You have to believe in what you are speaking into existence. Because what you are speaking into existence is actually creating the life for whatever it is that you're wanting to come into presence that's what's actually coming into existence whatever you're speaking is always coming into existence because this is the master manifester the mouth is the man of man the master manifester and whatever you speak into existence the moment you spoke it it's already done it's just that once again you have to go into the habit you have to get out of the habit of believing in your lower self believing in other people and believing in your situation Okay, and, and it's, it's it, I mean, it's obvious. People that's living a dream life, they tell us about this all the time. They tell us their dream story, they tell us their success stories, and they we see their life and we say, oh man, that is so marvelous. They're doing great things. They're spending all this money. They got these nice cars. They're living this dream life. She got her, her husband. He just bought her this big diamond ring, and he just bought her this, oh man, they're living their dream life. How is it that we're able to see other people who are no different from us doing what we want to do? That's because they are doing exactly what I'm telling you, which is believing in only what they see in their mind, in their reality. And they're not letting anything outside of themselves, themselves distort their vision. Okay. That is the biggest problem that most people deal with. Most people have a hard time manifesting their dream life because so many people are able to listen to TV. Listen to their mama. Listen to their auntie. Listen to strangers. And when strangers are sounding so convincing, oh, no, you can't do that. Yeah, yeah because, you, see, the first thing that you have to do is this. You have to, yeah, I did it before. You know, I've... You know, I got a degree, I got a law degree, and, and, and yeah, we went through it too. And, and No, you can't just do it like that. I know you see it like that. I know you think that it's going to come easy like that, but no, nah, it's, it's not going to happen like that. So many people will convince you with their own story that what you see in your mind is not possible because of what they went through of achieving it. Or not even achieving it. So like I said, the three things that you're constantly going against is your lower self other people in your current situation 
okay? And it's not impossible because we see other people actually doing it also, okay? So on my journey, the reason why, how I noticed I was becoming successful on my journey and I was manifesting this dream life that I always wanted, even becoming a vlogger right now. I'm him right now. <laughs> it's funny that I can say that because I am him right now. Okay, I'm like four going on five years into my dream life. I used to work, I used to do the regular things like everybody else did. Now I'm living in the land of the promise that was promised to me. I knew I was gonna be doing this way back then. You know what I'm saying? But how did I notice that I was actually tapping into it? It's because over a course of time, you notice how you slowly fly past people that ain't going nowhere. You notice how you go and you hang with your friends, you know, and you notice how when you go out in public places and you see people and they start talking, such and such and so forth. And you'll notice how your consciousness has changed so much that you don't even resonate with people that you once used to resonate with. You feel me? Speak or let your voice be heard if you if you are actually um, experiencing this right now, because if you're experiencing this right now, then you are you're manifesting your dream life with no struggle, okay? And this is stuff nobody don't tell you folks, but you know, I got into a I got into a habit of, of like every time I went somewhere, I could tell what my type of presence of people would be because I didn't feel any resonation when I went to a certain destination. I'm like, yo, they're not like me. I'm a little bit not better than them, but I can tell that I've become more positive than they have. You know what I'm saying? And it's funny because when you go around the people that you know you've, you know, you've leveled up from, you you start to feel like you're draining your energy because it's like you're always giving your energy away to people that are draining your energy. You know what I'm saying? So that's another thing that you can um, understand on your journey to manifesting your dream life with no struggle. You just start to notice how you just fly by people. And next thing you know, you like up here. And other people are like still like right here and you're just like, yo, so I'm having to like take care of you now. Like you're depending on me now. Once upon a time, I used to depend on you. Now you asking me for stuff. Now you asking me for money. <laughs> if you're a YouTube vlogger now, you're asking to be in my videos. Like, dang, what they do that at? You know what I'm saying? So, and so these are the things that you're going to come across on your journey when you are manifesting your dream life, you know? And another thing that will keep you from manifesting your dream life that will keep you struggling is if you keep continuously giving in to like fear, okay? Once again, this false reality, this fear, false evidence appearing real, this fear will always try to make you believe that the reality that you're living in right now is set in stone. You're gonna be here forever. But the truth is, Every trouble, every problem that you're facing is always temporary. Has it not been? Look at your past life and everything that you've accomplished right now. It was always temporary. You always got over it. You always rose up because it was always temporary. So you just got to live in the moment, facing the fears that you're facing, just knowing and still standing on your mountain. Like, you know what? It's... <laughs> Right now, I laugh in the face of adversity. I'm so good at like understanding how my mind and my words create my reality. When something negative happens in my reality, I laugh at it. <laughs> Weakness. <laughs> Fear, doubt, <laughs> doubt. They're doubting, oh my God. See, I've accomplished that level, they're, they're doubting. You know what I'm saying? When you get to a habit with fear and doubt, don't even bother you no more. You're doing great things. You're actually manifesting your dream life without no struggle, okay? And another thing that you got to do in order to manifest your dream life is you got to continuously see yourself without lack. I'm going to say that once again. You got to continuously see yourself without lack, okay? A lot of people stay in the ruts and they stay in the gutters, in the hoods and the ghettos of their thought patterns because they cannot get out of seeing their situation in lack, the one thing I did on my journey in order to rise above my lack situation, my situation where I was not attracting money the way I needed to attract money and all this and that and, and find me a job and all this stuff, I started to see everything and everybody that I was with at that moment as like a part of my success story. 
they was helping me progress. When all actuality, if everybody, everything that's going on around you is helping you progress. The universe can only help you progress. You know, it can only forgive you of things that you did not do back then. So right now you are forgiven, but at the same time, you are getting more. Tomorrow you will get more than you have today. That's just the way the universe works. It gives you things and it forgives you of things. Okay, so you have to realize that the situation you're in right now, even though it's not the situation you want to be in right now, all of this stuff that the universe has placed around you is only manifesting your dream life. It's only manifesting your dream life because once again, you only get one life to live and you mean to tell me you ain't going to manifest your dream life. You're already in the process of doing it. It's, it's already being done right now as we speak. I'm just a voice box. I'm just a part of the universe and your reality. Thanks for accepting me in your reality to tell you that the dream has already come true. Okay. If you believe it and receive it, press thumbs up on this video. Make sure you share one of my videos today and subscribe right here by clicking my face icon. That's me. Click that face icon. Hit the bell notification so that you can be notified every time I upload new videos every single day. Check out one of these other videos right here in the meantime. Okay? So, this is how you manifest your dream life and this is what nobody ever tells you. It's already done. I just want to say congratulations. This is a part of your journey of achieving your dreams. I'll see you in the next video.